Hi everyone, this is Amswim40 from AngerBirdsNest.com. Today we're going to take a first look at Amazing Alex. See it right here on my home page. So let's take a quick look. Amazing Alex is Rovio's brand new game. Of course, they're the developers of Anchor Birds. They have taken a new look at Casey's contraptions, and they've revamped the entire thing. In my opinion, this is a, it's very polished. The graphics are very good. Very smooth gameplay. I believe that this is going to have Game Center support. Well, I know it's going to have Game Center support. This seems to just be a temporary hang-up if you see this right now. Um, so unfortunately, I can't show you the Game Center aspects. Anywho, so let's take a look. This is Alex. Alex seems to be very bored by his schoolwork. He has no real interest in doing that. So instead, he has a very, very powerful imagination. And instead, he wants to create big Rube Goldberg machines. So these are the first couple levels of Amazing Alex. Uh, I'm going to just play through them without a whole lot of dialogue. It's pretty obvious what you're trying to do. You're trying to take the soccer ball, collect all the stars, and get it into the laundry basket at the end. It's really pretty simple. Uh, one nice thing here, you can share and view solutions through Game Center. Again, it seems to be a very temporary thing since the app was just released a couple hours ago. Um, something seems to have gone wrong with that uh, Game Center support right now. But we assume that that will be fixed in probably by the end of the day. So now you start getting into things that are a bit more uh, a bit more complicated. Here we have this uh, shelf, and we're being told to drag the shelf onto this outline space. If we needed to, we could rotate it either clockwise or counterclockwise. And then whenever you're content with how things are, you hit play and you let your soccer ball roll. So, again, the first few levels of Amazing Alex are going to be almost painstakingly easy. If you're really looking for a challenge, unfortunately, it's going to take you a, a little bit before you get to the more challenging levels. But let's take a look at what happens when you do something wrong. Okay, Obviously, this setup should not work. Um, but here you see the idea of chain reactions. You have multiple... Um, balls that are in motion. The end goal was to get the tennis ball. But since I failed, all I have to do is tap and come back and I can adjust all my items. Uh, I'm telling you, there will end up being more than one item that you can actually use. Um, so now you can see it and this is the sort of idea that we're going to work with. Uh, not all the time are you going to have to get things into a basket. Sometimes there's different objectives. These will be said, I mean, you can see how clearly that these are marked as to what you're actually supposed to do. Um, but this is our first look. Uh, I'm going to try very quickly to get to an, a new item, so uh, excuse me while I play quickly. Uh, Quick things about Amazing Alex, it's available right now for iOS and Android. Uh, if you're going to get the iPhone or just the regular uh, cell phone mobile device version, uh, it's 99 cents. If you want to get the HD app for tablets, it is $2.99. Android actually has a free version it appears to be the full version of the app, just ad supported. Um, but all three of these are available, whether you get the free, the regular mobile, or the HD. These are available on both Google Play and Amazon. Um, so there, anyways, you saw a um, an additional item, which is um, a book, which is nice nice to see that they're encouraging people to learn. Uh, this is also a level where your objective is not simply to get a ball into the laundry basket. Your goal is to get this top box to hit the floor. So, 
it's kind of nice to have this Game Center support. Unfortunately, I can't really show it to you because the Game Center integration is not working at this time. But if you're stuck on a level and you have a couple friends who are playing, you can maybe find, figure out what their solution is. If you have a friend who's struggling and you know how to solve it and you don't have screen recording software like we do, you can share it. So these are things that are pr pretty nice. Um, hopefully I can show you a few other things so you can see how many levels there are, things like that. Um, there's a hundred levels right now at launch. So you can see the different locations where we're going to go with Alex. Um, there's new levels that you can download. You'd have to search the web in order to find them. So things like these, these are kind of hand-created levels, I believe. Um, you can share them, you can upload them to the web when you create your own levels. And so you can see the instructions here. There's plenty to work with. Um, and whenever you've created a level, those will be stored right here. And as the instructions say, you can do things like share them online. Um, I think you can probably share them through Game Center as well. Uh, so this is going to be a very fun app. I think it's going to be good for... Oh, sorry about this. I don't understand why my version is getting a bit funky right now. Anyways, uh, I do think this is a fun app. I think it's going to be particularly fun for younger kids. Um... But I do think as the levels get harder, it will be entertaining for um, older people as well. I don't think that this is going to be the next Angry Birds. I don't think it's going to be that big of a hit. Honestly, I don't think we're ever going to see something that big ever again. Uh, that's just something that's way, way too big to even comprehend uh, how big an app would have to get in order to surpass Angry Birds. But I do think that this is very polished. I think it runs very smooth. I think it's a nice twist on Casey's contraptions. And you can look around. I guarantee there's going to be some very fun Angry Birds Easter eggs kind of hidden around uh, in some of these levels. Okay, That's our first look. Be sure to check out Angry Birds Nest and Rocket Pond for all your gaming needs. Take care, everybody.